G'day Rail Oilers, this is Lushington Brady and I'm here in Launceston's sunny Brisbane Street Mall. As you may be aware, Tasmania's Parliament is currently debating transgender legislation very similar to that proposed for New Zealand. So I thought I'd come here and ask some Tasmanians just exactly what they thought about the proposed laws here. New Zealand is looking to pass very similar transgender legislation as they're trying to put through in Tasmania at the moment. Uh, what's your opinion on those laws? Well, I haven't got that much uh, opinion, so... Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I think it's alright. It's moving forward. <laughs> Just everybody has their own equal right. Like, yeah, we are who we are, and every individual should, yeah, have their choice. I have no issue with it. Yeah. I think everyone should have a fair chance. Yep. Well, I don't really know a lot about it, to be honest. I haven't got anything against it personally, whatever each individual wants to do with their own life and what they prefer, well then I, and it's the same as if you're gay, I mean, it's each to their own, I don't sort of judge. And yeah, judge. are you aware at all of what's in the laws? Uh, I'm not aware of that. But... No. 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 I mean, I've got to say I've been very busy and that's why I'm saying I don't know a lot about yeah. it and I do catch up with a bit of the news, but not... Yeah. Do you think the public have been consulted about this at all? No. 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 Well, obviously the one that most people are, seem to be aware of is that uh, it will be optional to record the sex of a baby on the birth certificate. No, I don't agree with that. Right. No, I right. don't agree with that. Right. Um, I think they should have the choice yep. later on in life. The other part of it is that anyone over 16 can fill in a statutory declaration, which I don't know if you've seen before, they're a very simple form, yep. and legally change their sex. They don't have to transition, they don't have to consult a psychiatrist or psychologist or anything. I could go into service TAS and, or the police station and lodge one of these forms right now and I could I'd legally be a woman. No, no. <laughs> yeah, I think they've taken it a bit too far. That makes the ones that are transitioning look, you know, puts a lot on them. Yeah. Yeah. The other, and the last part of it is that uh, the anti-discrimination laws will be expanded so that if you don't use a person's preferred pronoun, which might be he or she, but it might also be something like Z or Zia or they, and also if you use their, what they call their dead name, which is say it's a, a bloke who's decided to be called Sharon and you call him by his old name, Steve, that will actually become hate speech and legally prosecuted. Well, how are you supposed to know? Yeah, unless they... Unless that... Well, you're going to go around and say, oh, what do I know you by now? What am I supposed to know you by now? <laughs> yeah, well, that will, take, that will be um, classed as hate speech. Okay. <laughs> I, think, I think all this political correctness and that has gone on way too far. Yeah. I, can, I think, I can understand what you're saying, but... Oh. Um, 15 weeks. Sometimes people make a mistake, so, you know, but, yeah, like... Yeah. Oh, everything's just getting so technical, isn't it? You know, there should be um, space for error. Do you think the uh, public have been consulted or informed enough about this? Well, mm, probably not, because I really didn't know nothing until we just started chatting. Like, I didn't know it was going that far. So, yeah, maybe more awareness. Like, yeah. Well, there we have it. It seems that not a lot of people know very much about the laws at all. Most people, I think, are generally prepared to give transgender people a fair go, but when they find out what's actually contained in these laws, many people seem to change their minds. So there we have it. For Whale Oil Media, this is Lushington Brady.